Let's see what they have in store for us with the story. Unprecedented nightmare. Let's go. Uh, world lost a futile, futile struggle, a life as hollow as it is perpetual. Ooh. But no more, the power to grant my wish, the ultimate power, finally comes to rest in my hands. Of course, it's always around the wish. And now... Zaha? What? That childish, dispassionate king, those meek, obsequious gods, all of them obsolete. Zaha is the big bad guy? And none of it would have been possible without you. Without who? Oh, what the hell is this? What's going on? Is it something that he foresees? How does it feel having your happy ending? You've made peace with your brother, your battle is over. All your wants made into reality. Yeah, exactly. What the heck are you? It's time for me to get what I want. No hard feelings. <laughs> no hard feelings, really? What? It's something out of a nightmare, no? You have long been entombed, stifled, but I have liberate you from these twin-bodied vessels. Come forth, great crystal. What crystal? Oh shit, there was something instead of shallot? Inside of shallot? Oh, a blue and a red instead of shallot and giblet. It, whoa, wait, that has to be foreshadowing. They cannot be dead. Uh, beautiful is it not that world can truly give justice towards such a thing now let the halves be one again what's going on the light coming out of shot and giblet it's combining yeah what blasphemy is this? Just what does the swordsman think he's doing? So even an omniscient being such as yourself can be caught off guard. Bewilderment suit you well. How dare you? Uh, it seems my ruse is up. Well, you divinity, do you know what comes next? Well, I guess he's gonna kill him. What is that? You're... There are two master masterminds now. That's how it is. Come to think of it, you did have a way with your little magic tricks, didn't you? You and your dirty illusions. Jacko? Where's Jacko? All this time, right from the very beginning, this mastermind beside me was nothing more than one of your underhanded gimmicks. Good, maybe you're omniscient after all. Well, he's not because he would have seen it coming before. I suppose now would be an appropriate time to reintroduce myself. The mastermind, as Lord Beerus and Shadow Friend refer to him, the one who orchestrated this tournament of time, was me, Zaha. Pleasure to meet you, and I do assure you, the pleasure is all mine. To believe yourself capable of outwitting a god, I'm afraid you simply do not know your place. I mean, Zaha, it can be, yeah, okay, I don't believe it. Why, Zaha? Cool, Jacko, get hold of yourself. One more move here, and we can all be toast. Oh, yeah, I guess that's the plan. You grab Charlotte and get out of here. Well, you meet Charlotte's body? Why well, can't they heal him with a. Uh, with a uh, bean? It's like a, a sensu? Do you really think I intend to let any of you live alive? Yeah, obviously. Zamazu, after the unspeakable years, new people have dared to attempt penetrating on me. You think I'm going to let you just leave? Yeah, of course not. Who's gonna come to the rescue? Not even think about it, Zamazu. That voice is. There you go! Goku and Gohan, obviously. I like what they're doing with the story. Next part of the story. Let's go. So he's not there. I thought he had like a huge hole in, a, in his right side there, no? So he's still alive. There you are, you're nothing if not persistent, are you? Jacko, shout in danger, we gotta, we gotta what? 
He's too dangerous. Shut up. Get away from Zaha. Yeah, sure. Do you have a Sensu? You should listen to them short unless you have some unfinished business with me. Well, yeah, there is some unfinished business with you. You just pierced me with your arm. I guess after all this time, at the very least, you do deserve to have your question answered. Ah, so. When you're listening, I'm the one called the mastermind. Yes, tricking me the whole time. That's exactly what I did. Since when? From the very beginning. Or, to be precise, from before you came to this era. That's right, silly me. You're done and lost all your memories, aren't you? So, come on, refresh me. But I was also the one who erased your memories. Oh, shit. As far as you know, we first met when we rescued Gohan, but the truth is that by that time we had already met before. Okay. Seems like I've refreshed your memory. I first met you right after both of you arrived in this era. That's when I implanted the crystal into your bodies and erased your memories. Would have been harder to manipulate you with your memories intact. Plus, in order for my plan to reach fruition, I had to befriend you. I needed your trust. Even if I left Giblet to his own devices, I knew his hatred towards you and your kind would continue to blossom. But I couldn't afford the luxury with you. I had to get close to you, give you an objective, point you towards an evil to fight against. It took a lot of time and effort creating your every footstep. You disappointed for as long as we can remember, I really did try my best to be a friend to you. But I'm sure you did make some good memories along the way. Only happy to see how it kept growing stronger, didn't have fun fighting against powerful enemies. And even though you were just a pawn, even though I actually grew attached to you. Really? Truly grateful Charlotte fighting against Freezer said Majimbu, the death of the androids and Vegeta. You and your brother went along with each part of a magnificent plan, even fighting each other to the death, well, almost. It can be! Well, apparently it is. Ooh. Last part of the story, book 1, chapter 8. The Omnisense Crystal. Okay, what does that do? Beerus seems to... Oh no, Beerus doesn't know, that's a question mark. That is that supposed to mean, whatever that thing is... It's got enough kick to cancel out my Hakai? Oops. But I've never heard of anything that could do that. But you have. Better yet, you've used them before. What? The power to equal even a god of destruction, to resurrect the dead, to create, recreate an entire universe? All but one wish away. The Super Dragon Balls. What? This crystal is what you might call the prototype of the Super Dragon Balls. When it first came into my possession, it was nothing more than a shiny rock, unusable of failure. Mm -hmm. You put that thing inside those two twins and waited until they powered up by forcing them to conflict. You used them and them vessels to carry the thing for you until it was ready to use. Okay, I get it now. They're just farming, basically. You're gonna wish to destroy this universe or something? Why well, go through all the trouble with this crystal for then I could just use the Super Dragon Balls? What makes the crystal so special that you do all that to make it work? I think I know why. It's because that crystal can do something that Super Dragon Balls can't, isn't it? You truly are Divine Wisdom Manifest. I love it to say this. It depends on how you use it. To me, this failure is that superior is far superior of the dra Super Dragon Balls. But I will not do for me to be impeded by this two right now. Do you understand what I'm saying? Hmm? As long as he has that crystal, Goku's attacks poses no threat to him. Okay, curses. I feel like he need my protection was just another ploy, forcing my hand into using black, insolent little... Yeah, okay. But the Omniscient Crystal, what I just saw was amazing. His power is truly incredible. Okay, Zamazu is going to try to double Zaha, and as well as Black, obviously, because they're the same person. But don't fall, not even Beerus that can reach him. There's nothing we can do. There's something we can do. Hey, there he is. The man. Take Charlotte and get him away from here. Beerus orders. Okay. Charlotte is still breathing, although barely. You'd better hurry up. Okay, hold a minute. Just Charlotte, what about... No, 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 
We don't have enough time. Waiting longer might be too late. Okay, let's go, go, go. Looks like we gotta save it to a quite a pickle here, huh? I have to believe those two will be able to take care of Charlotte. As for my part, you're doing an awful lot of talking, but it seems you're all out of attacks. Is this your surrender? There's no point in attacking. Is if none of it is going to reach you and your crystal, is there? Hmm? Oh yeah. Hey, sounds like you surrender to me. So much for divine power. Don't let it get to you, Goku. As awful as it is, we're still standing. Yeah, well, not for long. We still have a shot. What shot? So there is some fight left in you? That's what I like to see. I can't stand to see you gloating with that crystal. There's still one little thing you should know. A word to the wise, if you will. There is no way this is ending here. What you've done is unforgivable. unforgivable. Yeah. Not your final act of resistance. You're all bark and no bite. If being a soul loser was a competition, you'd actually be winning. Alright, alright. You think we're soul losers, huh? Just wait and see. Just like Charlotte, it seems both of you are full of baseless confidence. How repugnant. Well, Beerus, if I recall correctly, you like to say something along the lines of before any creation must come destruction. Yeah, that's a line. And destruction might just be what is upcoming creation needs. I will finish you all with your very own technique. High time! Ooh. You work. Oh, we have to wait. Nice cliffhanger though. Because what Whis is going to do, Whis is probably going to reverse time, right? But then to do what if they cannot attack with the Hakai? Interesting. Okay, cool. Well, see you on the next episode, I guess. Be good.